we are witnessing the first real time disintegration of an interstellar traveler, an event that challenges our very understanding of what's moving through the dark between stars. Avi Loeb, the renowned Harvard astrophysicist, has just published a startling new analysis. His calculations point to a catastrophic event. The interstellar visitor known as 3i Atlas hasn't just cracked, the evidence indicates it has shattered into no fewer than 16 separate fragments. But the real mystery isn't the breakup itself, it's the bizarre and organized behavior happening within the cloud of debris. This isn't wild speculation. The evidence is grounded in hard data from the world's most powerful telescopes. The implications of that data are truly staggering. Think about the sheer scale of this. We are potentially watching the explosive death of a visitor from another sun, a cosmic drama playing out in real time. Our instruments are capturing the aftermath of its destruction. Yet, the official explanation is starting to show cracks, revealing a possibility that is far more unsettling. Let's walk through the evidence together. Our story doesn't start with the explosion, but with an impossible observation made months before the object reached its closest point to our sun. 3IA TLAS was first spotted in July 2025 by the atl AS survey in Chile. Astronomers knew immediately it was something special. This was only the third confirmed object from beyond our solar system we had ever found. And this third visitor was about to behave in ways that defy all our textbooks. By late summer, the James Webb Space Telescope trained its infrared gaze on the object. Its incredible sensitivity revealed a massive cloud of carbon dioxide gas, a coma stretching out nearly the distance from the Earth to the Moon. But the data was strange. The ratios of elements were off. The composition didn't perfectly match a standard comet. Then came the anomalies that truly stunned scientists. As 3i Atlas fell toward the Sun, it began to speed up in a way that gravity alone could not explain. It was experiencing a powerful non-gravitational acceleration, a push from an unseen force. To put it in perspective, this object, already traveling at immense speeds, was somehow getting an extra boost. But there's more. The comet was also changing color, becoming progressively bluer. This hinted at a strange makeup, possibly rich with metallic compounds that reflect light in unusual ways. Now, the conventional answer for the acceleration is outgassing. As a comet heats up, ices turn to gas and jet outward, acting like a natural thruster. It's a well-known process. But for 3i Atlas, the numbers simply don't add up. Between August and its October perihelion, the object's mass loss rate skyrocketed by a factor of thousands. It went from shedding a modest amount of material to ejecting millions of tons every second. The energy required to fuel this incredible outburst was the key. Loeb's calculations showed that to absorb and process that much solar energy, 3i Atlas would need a surface area equivalent to a sphere over 14 kilometers wide. Here's the critical problem. Earlier Hubble telescope images had already measured the nucleus. It was no larger than about two kilometers across. How could it grow 16 times larger in just three months? The math points to only one plausible conclusion. Fragmentation, a catastrophic explosion. If the object broke into 16 smaller pieces, the combined surface area of those fragments would perfectly explain the insane mass loss. The physics is clear, and this conclusion comes from a leading theoretical astrophysicist at Harvard. But this is where the simple story ends, because what happened next was anything but a simple cloud of dust. Just days after its close solar pass, astronomers on Earth captured images that changed everything. These weren't simple snapshots, they were highly processed revelations. The photographs showed 3i Atlas displaying something called an anti-tail, a jet of material pointing directly toward the sun, the opposite of a normal comet tail. Even more compelling, they revealed multiple distinct jets, not a chaotic cloud. These were organized columnated structures 
one stretching nearly twice the distance from the Earth to the Sun. These jets showed geometric precision, a pattern that suggests a directed, controlled outflow. And when Loeb analyzed the ongoing mass loss, he found it was still immense, requiring a nucleus far larger than the original. How can fragments maintain such powerful outgassing? What mechanism is at work here? The mainstream community points to natural comet fragmentation. It has happened before. But the models have inconsistencies. The interior temperatures don't quite match the breakup thresholds. And the organized jet structures we see in November suggest something more controlled than a simple explosion. This is where Loeb introduces his most controversial and important hypothesis. What if natural comet physics is insufficient to explain what we're seeing? What if 3i Atlas isn't a natural comet at all? Loeb carefully proposes that the organized jets and sustained mass loss could be signs of active propulsion, not passive outgassing. He is not claiming proof of aliens. He is stating that technological thrusters with their high exhaust velocities could explain the data more efficiently than comet physics. The geometric jets would be consistent with directional thruster arrays. We are not just observers, we are active participants in a cosmic mystery. The clock is ticking to find the truth. 3i Atlas will make its closest approach to Earth on December 19th. The Hubble and James Webb telescopes have crucial observations scheduled. Their data will be definitive. They will either show us a field of broken fragments, confirming a natural death, or they will reveal a single, intact nucleus producing these impossible jets. This is our only chance. Once this visitor leaves our neighborhood, is gone forever, taking its secrets back into the interstellar void. The observations we make in the next few weeks will become the permanent record. This is live science unfolding right now. By following this, you are part of humanity's first real, time-intensive study of an object from another star Think about what that means. This object arrived in our solar system at the precise moment in cosmic history when we had the technology to see it, to study it, to question it. Is it a messenger or merely a fragment of a distant world? The window is closing. By the new year, 3i Atlas will be a fading speck. We have one shot to answer the fundamental question. What is this interstellar visitor truly telling us? The fragments are real, the jets are real, the mystery is real, and the truth is hidden within the data waiting for us to find it. If you're captivated by this cosmic detective story, help us spread the mystery. Please like this video and follow the channel Winds of Thought for more journeys to the edge of understanding.